Hi Sagittarius, welcome to my channel Sagittarius. I hope you are doing well. I hope you are fine and safe and doing good Sagittarius. This reading for today, it is a collective reading for the Sagittarius sign. Let us see what is coming towards you Sagittarius. What is the guided message that is meant for you to know and ready for you to know. This is for the Sagittarius sign. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. Let us see what is coming towards you in love, career, money, and general situationship. This is for your sign, Sagittarius. Let's see what's coming towards you. What is your guided message? What can I get for the Sagittarius sign? What is your guided message? Look, I'm sorry, <laughs> too excited. <clears throat> Let's look into the recent past, okay? And then let's look into your current energies, okay? The Knight of Wands. The Six of Pentacles in here. You have the Four of Cups. What's coming towards you in the immediate future? You have a Seven of Swords. The Strength Guard. Who is this person? It's a page of pentacles. Okay, guys, this is really interesting. Okay, let's go towards the reading. Okay, all right. Okay, let me just look into the camera. And so we start your reading. So coming into the recent past, you have a nine of pentacles in here. It's possible, Sagittarius, that um, the nine of pentacles it speaks about single ready to mingle the nine of pentacles also speaks about stability um this is stability money it feels like your perfect storm is gone you know the nine of pentacles speaks about you being powerful and surviving a very emotional or stressful situation okay now this nine of pentacles in here it's connected to a knight of cups so I feel like the nine of pentacles in here and the knight of cups, the nine and the knight is that you might not have the support of this person or you don't have this knight of cups, but you've got peace of mind or stability, okay? Because the nine of pentacles, you're available, you have peace of mind, you have stability, you're not looking after, like you're not after the knight of cups because you've got stability in here let's look at the nine of pentacles in here yes six of wands the strength card i could feel that this past energy is accepting i'm grateful you know i feel like the nine of pentacles is you you're grateful for your achievement for your money for your life for your stability for your freedom that you don't have to chase the knight of cups it's a feeling of I don't have to chase you knight of cups because I feel victorious without you with or without you I'm fine so you survive something because this is like I'm so grateful the knight of pentacles I will never have it any other way so you're confident that without them you're okay because you're single you can still replace them you're not after the knight of cups you know, because the Six of Wands, rising, winning, strength card, surviving. So, it's possible, Sagittarius, that you're proving people that without them, you're going to be fine. Without this person, you're going to be fine. For some of you, you even exceeded the expectation. Without them, you're even much better. So, there's a advantage of not having them like you are able to survive something without them and so you don't need them or you don't want them or because you're so grateful with your life you don't have to chase them like this is a this is a very spiritual and higher self kind of energy where you know what sunshine i don't have to chase them or go after them because i am so blessed or i'm grateful with or without them like you don't need them because you have the nine of pentacles 
you're great you're better with or without them so you have found your way back to yourself your mojo in here six of wands the strength card let's look at this knight of cups because you want them but they don't want you so you've decided to go solo like i find this knight of cups not supportive of you so you did not want them anymore you didn't want it the knight of cups it's complicated to deal with this person or situation you're okay with or without them i could feel you're moving on i could feel you've got more money you've got more time you've got more stability you're more peaceful without this knight of cups yes but this knight of cups they're complicated that's why they didn't join you this knight of cups that you were after and then you stop chasing it because you realize that life is still good without them now this knight of cups they were not with you they didn't join you but it doesn't mean that they won't join you in the future because there's a four of pentacles in here i think this knight of cups is confused something is complicated something is confusing so they've turned their back away from you because they're confused or something is complicated they are turned their back but it doesn't mean that they're not going to turn around okay that's so strong in here because there's a four of pentacles like ten of wands you and i sagittarius it's complicated so i'm gonna turn my back away from you but i'm not gonna move on from you i'm just gonna look the other direction okay there's a six of cups now they miss you this is the current energy or the connecting energy between you and this person this is already a situation that took place in the past or something recently let's look at the six of cups in here yeah they kind of give up on you temporarily oh eight of wands look this is gonna come around in august end of july someone in the past who turned their back will turn around and will offer you the knight of cups energy like you were wondering what happened to this person they were supposed to come back to me message me they regret that it could be around the month of june Ooh, six of cups again could be an ex but right now this person is missing you but they won't take an action right now this knight of cups they're missing you they will turn around they will give you the knight of cups i think it's more of end of july going towards the month of august or it could be soon because it's a leo season already let's see one more please i don't think they're in a hurry but they will turn around and face you yeah they're thinking of what sort of effort like how they will show up how they will call you how they will text you how how what sort of movement um right now this person miss you and soon they will shift their energy sagittarius to how am i going to reach out okay i feel like it's a best friend or a lover okay now let's see what else is coming towards you this is you sagittarius the knight of wands in like in real time current energies so we just had the full moon in capricorn and we're shifting towards the leo sea i mean it's already leo season with the full moon sorry with the full moon and the leo season um you're excited something tells me that a lot of people will be coming back into your life sagittarius you're the knight of wands something tells me knight of wands the six of pentacles in here you will have to plan your schedule sagittarius because you're going to be in demand in professional and personal okay leo season you're going to be vibrant like you're going to be shining your problem <laughs> with the four of cups this is what the universe and your higher self is wanting you is encouraging you is that you're going to have a lot of invitation you're going to have a lot of attention you're going to like you're the life of the party 
Sagittarius. Um, the month, end of July, moving towards August. There's so much invitation. There's so much. There's so much invitation. There's so much attention. What the universe would like you to look into is that make sure that your calendar or your your calendar or your schedule it has a space for yourself because it looks like you are not you're gonna be out and about you will be staying a lot of you will be doing lots of activities outside your home your house and I'm really getting like left and right you're gonna get some invitation attention for some of you you're just the plus one you know four of cups for some of you guys you would know this you're the plus one in an event and yet you're getting attention a lot of people will je will be jealous of you you would notice the way you dress the way you talk it's gonna be regal it's gonna be royal it's gonna be what you say it's your your mood is very vibrant and it's gonna reflect your personality in the way you dress so lots of eyes on you Sagittarius for some of you five of swords you're gonna go on a diet like for some of you guys, you will get lots of compliment with your skin. If you're going through some physical glow up, you're going to receive a lot of compliments. For some of you, um, you're really putting a lot of time into your style, in the way you talk, in the way you write your emails, write your communication. You're very, po like, you're very polished, like you're exemplary. Okay, couldn't even pronounce it, but... You're very polished. You're very, you're very polished. I don't know where is Mercury. I'm stammering. Sorry. You're very polished. You're very glamorous. That your popularity is so. Like you're very popular, and for some of you, five of swords, page of cups. A lot of people will be jealous of you. You might receive some, like compliment, but it feels like a an evil eye. It's like oh. You have a nice bag, but there's a jinx. So make sure that you are hanging out with the right people. A lot of jealous. A lot of people will be jealous of you. There's fame. There's popularity. Also, for some of you guys, <laughs> this is so funny. You will also experience like you will be invited. This friend will not be invited. Like you've got this friend. You will be invited and the other friend would not be invited so there's a lot of special invitation that you would get and some of your friends wouldn't be invited so there's a vip treatment with you sanitaries you're gonna be a vip again the six of pentacles look i see you committing to have fun there's so much commitment there's so much invitation commitment party i'm seeing you I'm seeing you enjoying it. I'm seeing you feeling more alive, feeling like you enjoy. You will enjoy it definitely, but just make sure with the five of cups in here, the universe is encouraging you that Sagittarius, look after your time because it looks like a lot of your time it's spent outside, outgoing. Okay, there's a lot of outgoing energy in here. Yeah, eight of pentacles in here. Like you're working after work, you party. And then you have little time to spend connected to your higher self, to your house, to your home. So make sure that there is a balance in the way you spend your energy. Don't forget your solitude. Okay? Find, strike a balance between the party, the working, and your solitude. It's important to have time to yourself to reflect upon life like something is so noisy that you have to find some inner peace like in a week to uh, to spend it to your solitude Sagittarius okay it keeps you grounded it's gonna be a busy month or at least the next three four weeks you know after the Capricorn full moon it's gonna be a busy end of July especially the August you're stylish you're talkative, you're vibrant, you're polished. You're gonna be, va you're gonna be very popular. You're gonna be VIP, okay? And it's so funny. I'm really picking up a vibe in here that your friends, they're not gonna be invited. You will be invited, so you'll have a bit of a jealous people around you. But you know how to handle it, okay, Sagittarius? 
So enjoy your season to shine. Now, what else is coming towards you? What else is coming towards Sagittarius? Seven of Swords. Hmm. Stubborn. The Page of Pentacles. You know what? The Seven of Swords. This is... Let's look at the Seven of Swords. I'm so intrigued with the Seven of Swords, Sagittarius. The Queen of Wands. Someone realized that you're the Queen of Wands. There's a person... In the next three to four weeks, there is a person and they realize that you're... <sighs> I heard it. Okay. So, there's a person. They realize that you are their one true love. Or they realize that they have betrayed or let go of a queen of wands. You're rare. Someone realizes that you're rare, you're one of a kind, you're once in a blue moon, and they've let you go because of their ego, their stubbornness. This person is going to find a way to rewind, do it all, of, do it all over again with you. You know, for some of you guys, this could be a person seven years ago, seven months ago, so it could be an ex. Mm. Seven to nine years ago for some of you guys. Someone is realizing that you are the Queen of Wands. Seven to nine years ago in here. Could be Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo energy, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy, the Strength card. They will message you. They will test the water. Someone is going to test the water if their charm is still going to be effective with you. They're shy. Then... They're hoping that you have moved on from the past. Two of Cups, look at that. They're going to work on with the Two of Cups. Oh, wow. Like, you know what? This person is very, very nervous, but very intrigued about how you have become after the separation or after they ghosted you or after, I don't know. I don't know how long it is that you didn't connect but this person is going to work on with a two of cups moment with you they will message you they know that you will reject them but they will try like you know what this is like seven years ago nine years ago or maybe seven nine months ago but i wonder how are you sagittarius let me check on you with the page of pentacles in here it could be a lover, three of cups. I am happy to be your friend, to be acquainted with you. Like they would even downplay it. They will tell you, hey Sagittarius, how's things with you? I hope you're well. Can I, you know, I'm just really worried about you or thinking about you. I have no intention to mess up your life or something. They're quite defensive. They're downplaying their intention, but their intention is a two of cups. You know, Maybe we could catch up or, you know, um, three of cups. Like somehow this person is giving you a vibe that maybe we should be acquainted again, reacquainted, or we should be friends. I have nothing but, you know, good wishes for you. But deep inside, there's a two of cups in here. Their, mot their motive is a two of cups. It's a love energy. But they would say that this is just some sort of friendship or this or that. Yeah. They're still hoping. They will downplay their intention. You look, 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 Sagittarius. Their energy is good. But they, they're kind of telling you right away that I'm not here to reconcile. It's just friends, just checking in. But deep inside, there's a two of cups. They're just, you know, waiting for the right moment to see whether they could begin some romance with you. I'm really hearing the word. They're, they're downplaying it. This is what I have for you, Sagittarius. Thank you so much, guys, for supporting the channel. Thank you so much, guys, for being here. I will see you soon again, guys. You have a great day. Bye-bye.